Supporters lined up this morning outside the Bossier Parish Library History Center. It was set up as a secondary polling location for early voting. The main location, Bossier Parish Clerk of Courts Office at the courthouse in Benton. Many families are heading to the polls together this year. NBC 6's Sydney Simone spoke with people about the importance of younger generations voting. She joins us now live from Bossier City with more. Sydney? Well, good evening, Dan and Jackie. Many parents and teachers stress the importance to young adults about not just voting, but voting early. No matter which party you choose to vote for, many early voters in Bossier Parish want the youth to know that their vote matters. Oh my goodness, I'm a retired social studies teacher and voting is something I emphasize to my students all the time. Um, it, it's what our country is founded on. Residents say the youth is the future of our country. Their votes can be the most influential in an election. His future is really based on him going, getting out and vote as far as uh, what he wants and what he would like to see for everyone else. Some residents believe that the youth makes up a more diverse population. Thoughts and opinions of younger generations are valuable in today's society now more than ever. They need to learn and they need to learn to stand for what they believe in and stand firmly and make it public. I think it's a great thing. Martha Glassy, a 16-year Louisiana teacher, says everyone's vote counts. It's your civic responsibility and if you don't vote, then that is a vote for someone else. You know, that it, that you, and you have no right to complain about who your leaders are at that point. As long as you're in line by 7 o'clock, you can cast your ballot. Now check this out. I'm going to step out of the frame here, but I want you to take a look at this. There is no line. Earlier today, the line was wrapped around the building. I spoke with some voters who came outside, and they said the entire process took five minutes. That means walking inside, signing in, casting your ballot, and walking out. But one thing I want to point out, please do not forget to bring your mask. If you don't have a mask, you won't be able to go inside. You won't be able to vote. Reporting live in Bossier City, Sydney Simone, NBC6 News. Back to you, Danny Jackie. Yeah, good to see so many people making their voices heard. All right, Sydney, thanks. Well, if you can't make it to the polls today for